Welcome back to Chow Time Pod. It's your host, Red. We got a video today from The Quartering. Jim thought banned for being entitled brat and the backlash is epic from Joey Swoles. Oh. Please like and subscribe down below. I really appreciate that. Let's get that chow. It's chow time. Jim influencers might be literally the worst content creators on the planet. Uh, they generally aren't really interested in getting fit. They're interested in... That's what a lot of you guys think that gym influencers are probably one of the worst out there. I think the prankers are probably the worst, but gyms, gym, gym, gym influencers are up there. Selling you like uh, prawn adjacent content, you know, they, they work out content, which happens to have their, you know, their rear end in perfect focus the entire time, all this kind of stuff. Well, there's also a common trend with these individuals and they generally tend to be terrible people too. That's and true. once in a while, you get a little bit of justice and now somebody who goes by the name Joey Swole, which you may have seen featured on this channel before, ended up getting a woman's gym membership canceled Ooh. after she mocked a man working out. Absolutely love to see it. Make sure you leave a like on this video to support this based Chad, at least the guy who was working out. Let's take a look at the, the, the overview. Going to wear a shirt. Can you at least have some muscles? Listen, I get it. You want to train at a gym where everyone keeps their shirt on? That's fine. But this gym isn't one of them. I called Absolute Recomp in Texas, and their rules say you can train with your shirt off, and you signed up there. So, by the way, this girl took a picture of somebody. Um, you know, she films a man who is training at the gym and uh, without a shirt on and makes fun of him for not being ripped or something like that. Therefore, you need to follow the rules, including the rule that says you don't film people without their consent to post on social media. And people tried to tell you this. Yet you arrogantly posted your response when they tried to defend this man and you didn't try here's, to try here's to defend response, this man. Here's the response, by the way. This says, hey, as a fellow woman in the gym, I don't know if this is the best way to represent yourself. Hopefully you hear this out of love, but the fact that there is, uh, there's in huge, in and of itself, I'm not sure, uh, not sure that making fun of others at the gym has any real benefit to it. If anything else, it tears it down, to which they replied, did it ever occur to you that I'm not tearing him down for being at the gym it's 100 percent possible to work out with clothes on there's no reason male or female should walk around uh this be without clothes on for a multitude of reasons let me educate you you know what trust me if i can walk around the gym without my shirt on i'd actually love that i'm at home without my shirt on majority of the time anyways i'm usually just in my boxers it's just more comfortable and like when you actually get to see all of the you know, the muscle fibers do everything when you don't have your shirt off when you look at the mirror. I'm not saying I'm going to go take off my shirt, but if the gym allows it, why not? Since you boldly wanted to slide into my DMs. Okay. I'm sure she wears sweatpants when she's at the gym. Posted your response when they tried to defend this man and you didn't listen. Therefore, you get me. I also find it funny that you post calling them keyboard warriors. All right? You, you, you fuck with the, the low beast. Big boss comes along. You're going to get trounced. If you're a keyboard warriors, if you don't like the things I post, unfollow me. Or we go to the same gym. You know exactly where to find me. Ooh. Now, who is this person? Well, what? they go by the ripped Barbie. And uh, apparently their link doesn't work anymore. I'm not oh. really sure. It looks like they, they may have... They may have hid their Instagram now. I think that's that that may be what have happened here, you know. Now this is who that individual is. It doesn't look like they're dressing very uh doesn't really seem like they are dressing very modestly. Nope. It looks like they were taking a little bit too much heat, huh? <laughs> it looks like maybe being a crotch didn't work out for you. It looks like maybe the clout wasn't work, worth it because uh I don't see you anywhere. There appears to be posts about about you. I don't mm -hmm. know. These are all different people, so I don't know what's going on here. That if you go to the same gym, they should come and find you. That they should speak to you face to face. Yet you think it's okay to film that man and make fun of him literally behind his back without him knowing. All right. And just a heads up, they can't find you at that gym anymore because I talked to the owner and your membership has been canceled. Yeah. <laughs> you need to do better. Mind your own business. Now, Ooh. I don't know if men do this to other men at the gym. I'm not going to just cape for them and say they definitely don't. But I do, I will say that there seems to be a lot of women that do this. Yes. A lot of them. There are some men. I actually covered a few videos of men making fun of other men in the gym and stuff like that. It, it happens very seldomly, though. It does happen. But it's women that really want to post the creep, the he should you know, be ripped if he was going to do some of these things kind of poses.
She goes on to make hurtful remarks about the man's appearance while complaining that he was training shirtless. The video on Instagram sparked outrage online, with many calling out Allie from the clip and film for filming, filming somebody without their knowledge. But the fitness vlogger was not phased, instead labeling them keyboard warriors. It was at this point, fitness influencer Joey Swole stepped in, made a video addressing the problem, and began by highlighting it was perfectly valid for her to want to go to a gym where you can't work out shirtless. But he pointed out it was not that kind of gym. I get that too, I suppose. Um, I called Absolute Recomp in Texas. They said you can train with your shirt off and you signed up there. So, you know, I would say that that's, uh, you know, you know, it's because of that Absolute Recomp gym were less than impressed with the video and canceled Ali's membership. Joey concluded your membership has been canceled. You need to do better. Mind your own business. Damn right. People took to the comments to share that instant. Oh my God, I love this. I hugely prefer gyms that don't allow shirts off, but I would never shame anyone for doing it at a gym where it's allowed. Correct. So said, I signed up for Planet Fitness today. And when I tell you that this is my worst fear, I'm hoping Planet Fitness is safer. I'm assuming they're talking about people filming him or them without their consent. The third reply, the gym should be nothing but motivation and helping people grow. Yeah, I mean, I would say so. You know, I would definitely say so. I mean, I don't know. This guy's not exactly in bad shape. I don't know why you would want to work He's out not. without your shirt on because you're going to sweat all over everything. But I suppose even if you do work out, like I guess when I work out in my home gym, I don't wear a shirt because then I don't have to have another sweaty shirt in the laundry exactly. for my wife to clean. My shirts get sweaty. I do think it's interesting, you know, that they decided to go with the run as opposed to the here's. Okay. So here's this one. Yeah. It keeps saying. I keep saying it's unavailable. So I'm, guess, I'm guessing they're just gone. I'm guessing they just hit the bricks. Yep. And that's good. You know, I don't think that, you know, ultimately, oh, you have the Rip Barbie. Yeah. Allie posted a video of sharing a man for shirtless picture. Oh, from it's, it's TikTok. So they're on TikTok. I wonder if they're, I wonder, um, let's see. Hmm. Joey Swole replied, Rip Barbie. This is probably them. I'm guessing. No. I don't know. Uh, she got deleted. I don't know. Or deleted herself. I don't really care. I don't really use TikTok. I don't really understand it. <laughs> it's I don't understand very difficult to navigate. Why these people, um, you know, why these. You know, as he's on this subject of TikTok, brothers, that shit is so hard to navigate if you guys don't ever use that shit. I don't even know how to get videos sometimes. Why you would film somebody when they're trying to just work out. But this is a very common thing. Here's another one. Woman banned from gym after complaining a man got in the way of her video. Why are guys like this? Who invited him to come out in my video? God, give me patience. That was a damn good story. Shout out to the quartering. Shout out to Joey Swoles putting women in their place, getting them banned, getting them removed for doing fuckery. Please like and subscribe down below. I really appreciate that. Catch you guys next time. Ciao.